going to teach you how to do the DIY satin shorts for Valentine's Day or just to hang around in. They're super cute and super easy. So let's get started. Okay, you will need one yard of satin fabric, some one inch elastic, fabric scissors. I couldn't find my straight ones, so I used some design ones, some needle and thread, and some pins. Now, for my pattern, I just used some basketball shorts and just traced it on some cardboard paper, folded it in half and traced it. But you can use the basketball shorts itself as long as it's folded in half and you know to cut two of them. So now I have my pattern laid out on my fabric. I'm just going to cut on the fold and I'm going to do this twice. So I will have both legs of my shorts. Now that I have it both cut out, I'm having it face together and along this line here, I'm going to place pins because you're going to straight stitch down the line. This is going to be the part in your crotch area where you have your legs coming out. So we're going to make sure that's all together and tight. Now that you have it both sewed up on both sides, I'm going to show you how to pin it together so that you can know how to stitch the rest of the shorts together. So you're going to turn it inside out like so. Then you're going to take both crotch areas and you're going to place hold them together where the seams line up. Make sure that it lines up correctly. Then you're going to take some pins and you're going to hold that in place. This is going to be the starting point. This is where you should start sewing. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to continue holding up both sides of the fabric together. Make sure that it lines up correctly and just place pins along the back. And you're going to do that on both sides just to make sure everything looks correctly. Now, I have the shorts inside out now just to make sure that everything is lined up correctly with the pins before I sew it down. And this is just one side. Now I'm going to straight stitch down. Then I'm going to turn it over and put pins on the other side and straight stitch down that side. Now, your pants are almost done. So what you're going to do is... Take the top part, which is the part that your waistband is going to be, where your waist is going to be. And you're going to fold it over enough so the elastic can fit in. And you're going to straight stitch around, around that part. The elastic I cut already, but it fits around my waist. And I left one inch for seam allowance. The bottom you're going to fold over twice. And you're going to hem. So now just entering in my elastic around my waist now the elastic is in I put a pin right where the two ends meet and then I'm going to sew that down and close up the back and this is the finished product of your shorts your little pajama shorts wasn't that easy guys <laughs> I try to make it easy as it can be so this is the finished product how it looks on me thank you for watching please subscribe like comment please tell me what I can do better next time and I will